As you know, this week was the Iowa caucus in which Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton essentially tied, despite the fact Hillary had all the media, all the corporate support, all the establishment support, and all the CNN anchors. So, so this is basically David vs. Goliath. It's Larry David vs. Goliath. <laughs> Let's take a look at the heart-stopping action. The first moment of truth is at hand right now. This is the balloting. They just did last call for the ballots. Look, they stuffed them all into these popcorn baskets. This is also where the counting is going to be going on. This table right here, in just a few minutes, look at we're stuffing. This is what a capacity crowd looks like as the ballots are being put into the baskets. They're going to be counting them manually in just a few minutes. Some of them have started leaving, but some of them are going to hang around to see what the count looks like, Wolf. This is where it gets exciting. What are you talking about? This is where it gets exciting? This is scary as f I've seen secret Santa gift exchanges that are more technologically advanced. Pieces of paper? We don't even use paper money anymore. You give someone a dollar bill nowadays, they act like you just handed them a used tissue. Where's the technology? I have an app on my phone that tells me when to drink another glass of water, and you're using slips of paper to pick the next president? The Koch brothers are worth $100 billion. The Chinese economy is collapsing. The coral reefs are dying. You need a college degree agree to get a lawn maintenance job now. Corporate control of 40% of the world was signed by Obama yesterday, and you think they couldn't rig your popcorn buckets? <laughs> who? Who do you think owns the popcorn buckets? Huh? Who owns the popcorn buckets? I don't even trust that CNN guy not to start ripping up Bernie Sanders' votes. Keep an eye on that squirrely-eyed motherfucker. <laughs> we need pitchforks, not popcorn buckets. And half of those uh, Iowans are farmers. You have pitchforks. You own them. You have axes and saws and hatchets. You're a cornucopia of to bludgeon someone with. I say beat your popcorn buckets into swords. <laughs>